Hey everybody, Jamie here, Nomadic Rev. Welcome back to another video. Um, doing a little project today that I thought I would just uh, shoot a quick video for. Um, I already went and picked up what I needed, but basically I'm trying to come up with a better solution for my privacy curtain than a, that's basically a marker for snow plowing and it's broken, cracked and sagging pretty bad. So what I'm hoping is that the piece that I bought today, um, whoops. I'm hoping that the piece that I bought today will help me bend into position to um, match the ceiling and then hopefully it'll give me more um, privacy, so I don't know what just fell. No idea, but stay tuned. Oh, it was my TV tipped over. Okay, so here's what I have just this flimsy. Um, like I said, driveway marker. And so what I bought is this steel bendable piece. And I think it's gonna work perfectly. So what I'll try and do is bend it to match the ceiling. I'm also gonna need a bigger piece of fabric too, but get this taken care of first. Ouch. Thing gives you slivers easily. So, what I'm hoping is I'm definitely gonna have to bend it either way. <laughs> Question is, will I bend it the right way? So, if I put this in here, I can use the seat actually. Hopefully I don't break my chair though. Actually, I'm not gonna do it that way because I am afraid I'm gonna break my chair. All right, attempt number one was off camera, but that is pretty darn close actually. So, obviously, I have to bend it here now and bend it there if I can. So, let's see. That's actually, even just that's going to go a long way, but... The nice thing is I can bend it here and I can bend it there as well. So I need to push this right about here. Okay. Basically, I'm just using my deck boards <laughs> to try and bend it into place. I don't think it's gonna be perfect, but 
it'll be a huge improvement from what I had especially when I get a larger uh, piece of fabric show you the inside so again I could and I probably am gonna need like a press which I have that I could use but the, ni the nice thing is it goes all the way up to the ceiling now and there's more bend that I can do and then I'm gonna need a I might get two of the same size or one bigger one I'm not sure yet but um, yeah this is gonna make a big difference the size is actually gonna work really well because um, it's 48 inches from my bed is 48 inches wide I believe and so this piece is 48 inches wide and there's a little bit of give for doing some of the bending so that's gonna that's gonna be ideal so I just closed the doors I got my window shades in um, I know there's some light coming in through that way but the most important thing is that nobody can see in now on the top. So if I get a larger fabric for the sides, um, I think leaving it like this is going to be just fine. The big thing is nobody can see in the back. It's a lot more sturdy. So just filling in, in these gaps now is the most important thing. So probably going to run to a thrift store and see what I can find. One other quick update I'll show you is I have my... Uh, old TV working with the rabbit ears plugged into the Jackery. So it's drawing between 18 and 20 watts with this TV. Um, but for an old TV, that's a pretty good picture quality. <laughs> so hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching.